Right now, a look at the division among leaders in Knoxville about the leadership and culture in the police department. Vice Mayor Gwen McKenzie said yesterday she's lost confidence in Chief Eve Thomas. Councilwoman McKenzie represents the 6th District in East Knoxville and went on to say KPD has a culture of racism. 10 News reporter Marissa Rio spoke with other leaders in the city. Vice Mayor Gwen McKenzie says KPD does not foster an inclusive environment. KPD Chief Eve Thomas says, quote, we are acting with urgency to confront difficult issues and eliminate any culture issues that threaten to compromise the integrity of the department and public trust. Former Knoxville Mayor Daniel Brown says in his experience, he couldn't recall major incidents with KPD, but he wants to see more diversity in the department. It's just going to take a lot of uh, people working together. And I, I like to see more African-Americans join the police force. City Council member Andrew Roberto says, quote, while I'm deeply supportive of our officers, I'm disappointed in the lack of leadership to address the culture problem within the department. What confidence I have left in Chief Thomas is dependent on how promptly she addresses these issues. City Council member Janet Testerman also sent a statement. In part, she says, I have confidence in Chief Thomas and in the nearly 400 brave officers. She says racism is still unacceptable and must be eradicated. Local leaders, though, say they have faith for the future of KPD. It's just going to take people working together, especially people in the community. In Knoxville, I'm Marissa Rios reporting. Knoxville Mayor India Kincannon did express full confidence in both the mayor and KPD. In response to criticism, the mayor listed a series of positive changes underway, saying she trusts Chief Thomas to handle challenges and move KPD forward.